Welcome back to the water level. I'm gonna get that Yoshi coin. Oh, there's another Yoshi coin already. There's that weird fish that has goggles. Lots of sea urchins around. Come on, get out of my way. You guys are slow. Oh, great. Then again, everything underwater, everything in every water level is always super slow. Except for the bullet bills, which apparently aren't impeded by water. These Yoshi coins are really easy in this level. Hey there, torpedo dudes. Surprised it didn't die there. There's a school of fish that don't know how to swim, so they need goggles. Can I go over this thing? No, I can't. Sometimes I'll let you do that, and there's a secret at the other side. Where are we going? Sunday Islands 3. Never would have guessed. Did not see that one coming. Hey, Chuck. Get out of my way, Chuck. You're very annoying. Oh, can I get it? Yes! I don't know why I saved after doing that instead of before, but whatever. Is there a shroom up there? Yeah, that was not smart. Nor was that. Well, great. Hey there, saw dude. Deathblock? Hello, Deathblock. You taste like death. Hey, Koopas. But Koopa is doing an awesome jig. Oh, and I messed him up. And I killed him. Such is the life of a Koopa. It mostly involves dying. Okay, what's in you? Okay, that was not smart. How do I get into there? Oh well, I don't really care that much. There's honestly not all that much could be. It's almost certainly either a 1-up or a mushroom. Fire flower. Whoa. And we won, and we're on a bridge. And we're already at Sunny Fortress! So is this the castle, or is it really just a fortress? Whoa, oh, ow. There's a similar staircase to that in one of the original Super Mario World levels. But I guess all castles are at least vaguely similar. Yep, that's death. That's a pencil. I can't jump over the pencil. Ow. Figures. Onward! Oh! Ow. And we're already at the end? Resnor? Oh! Iggy! Yeah, you suck. That's Iggy, right? I think the first one's named Iggy. And he's dead. But he drops circus balls, doesn't he? I used to just think he drops fireballs, but I think those are just circus balls. Come on. Oh! And it's the end of the demo! Well, thank you for making the demo. Oh, there's his email address. So if you like the hack, mail him and say so. Because it's a pretty good hack for a demo. Got a nice little overworld here, and a random ghost on the side there. So it's a plus. And there's some... The waves are oddly yellow. I'm just gonna pretend that's sunshine, instead of... What else it could be? And overall, I really like the... It's a neat idea for Hark, I guess, and... 
Oh, we're missing a secret. I did not even notice that level was red. Ow. I didn't even notice that bullet bill was in my face. And I hit the friggin' fast forward button. You know, I tried to slow down my fast forwards, but the way ZSNES does speed is sort of weird. So this is allegedly two times, but it's more like 16 times. If not like more. Oh right, spin jumps. Duh. I never think to- oh! Wow. I can't believe I missed that. That's so freaking obvious. And I almost died because of the freaking fast forward button. I should just like unmap that. Yeah, this was a really obvious secret. I can't believe I just didn't notice it. And I'm pretty sure I saw that key and thing before. I just did not think at all to get it. Ice cave secret. Oh. It's just a free one up. And a mushroom. Yep, it's a mushroom. Yay. Anyway, as a review, as I said, pretty good looking hack. It's nice and easy, which is good for me at least. Fairly good level design, just it's all plain vanilla stuff, which isn't necessarily bad. Stuff with new graphics is just always nice. And I'm not the biggest fan of the numbered level names. I prefer just you know, it could be like, Sunny Island, and this is Sunny Ocean, and this is something else. Just give them all unique names is what I like, but not the biggest deal either way. Anyway, thank you for making this neat little hack, and thank you YouTubers for watching!